वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल एंड मैंने ऑफ गाइस रिक्वेस्ट मी टू मेक अ वीडियो मेक अ वीडियो ऑफ दिस लैब विथ वॉइस ओवर सो हियर इट इज बिकॉज आई कैन अंडरस्टैंड लाइक टास्क नंबर थ्री एंड टास्क नंबर फोर इज क्वाइट डिफिकल्ट टू डू विदाउट एनी इंस्ट्रक्शंस और गाइडेंस सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एक्टिविटी और क्लाउड शेल एंड सर्च फॉर द बकेट and one more thing guys uh, in this lab there we have two project id and that is a more uh, this is a importance of this lab because uh, there are some uh, there are some task we have to perform in the project id 2 i will explain you how to check uh, on, on which project id we are okay so first of all just <coughs> log in with your credentials and open the bucket and click on create bucket and then uh, copy the gcp project id 1 click on that click on continue 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 and uncheck this check box and click on find grade continue and click on create and here from here you can see like uh, for example let me zoom in for you c f c f 6 okay uh, and here CF six, so that is the meaning of right now. I mean project ID one. Okay, so we have create one bucket. So let's check the score for task one, and we got a score. Then copy from export to equal to sign like this. Go to your dashboard and paste the command over here. Let me just increase the font. Okay, done. and paste this project id first project id like this so it's done no need to run this echo command then copy this command paste then copy this and paste then we are in task number 2 now copy paste then copy this now click on authorize wait for few seconds and it will be done so it's done now then copy this second command paste over here then copy third command paste then co copy fourth command and paste so it's done now click on check my progress for task number 2 uh wait for few seconds and it will be updated the score So it's done. Then no need to examining the file and no need to perform this task. You can simply come on this task, copy this command, paste over here, then copy this third command and paste. Now this is a very important task and many of you guys facing the issue. Now here is my one recommendation for you. If you have your uh, no <coughs> personal notepad, you can use that also. or otherwise you can use your uh, you can use online notepad so i am going to activate online notepad okay now copy this command paste over here like this and now please pay attention okay let me just zoom in for you so once i uh, run this command i got one output like this so just copy this like this and paste in your notepad and it's called a key which we need in the uh, next steps so yeah done so we have done with this task then copy this okay so for example uh, i copy this task and uh, if i just run this task so here you can see i'm not getting any content in this dot boto file so i'm just uh, closing this uh, file like control x and running this gsutil config n command copy this command and paste over here okay and again copy this command and paste if you get this uh, kind of content in on your first attempt after running this uh, command you don't need to run this command okay now many of you guys facing the issue while uh, finding this encryption key so please follow 
the way and the can uh, the um, keywords which i am copying okay because many of you guys what they do they they do not copy this and they try to copy this and try to find out the encryption key and because of one sp uh, little space uh, you can say extra space uh, they didn't get uh, exact output okay so just copy like this copy this click on this keyboard icon then click on control w and you will get this one search pop up paste that uh, hash encryption key and hit enter so here we uh, here we go now just go to a notepad copy this key come to your dashboard remove this hash and the like this and now how to save this nano file control x shift uh, y and hit enter okay so that's easy is this then copy this command paste over here and check the score for task number three so if you got a score then copy this paste over here then copy this one paste and we are done if you want you can run otherwise it's not uh, mandatory to run this command then we are in task number four now we have to copy this command paste over here then now please pay attention copy this encryption key like this then click on this keyboard uh, option click on control w and search for the encryption key like this so now we are in this encryption key and the, our uh, main encryption key is here so just use your up and arrow uh, down uh, keyboards button so just for navigate uh, uncomment uh, comment this thing like hash and uh, if you just go down so here you can see uh, description one description two description three so 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 just uncomment the description one copy the key from notepad and paste over here like this okay then again control x shift y and hit enter so we have done with this task then co just copy this thing and paste okay so once i run this task i got another key if you uh, here it is just copy this key the way we copy the first key then just remove this key and paste the new key okay then again go to your dashboard copy and paste again search for encryption key like this go to here control w click on search and hit enter again we are in this uh, we are here now just uh, uncheck this and just remove this old encryption key like this okay and then copy the new key and paste over here as simple then again save the file control x shift y hit enter okay so we are done with that then again copy this paste over here now what we have to do we have to comment the description uh, description key uh, one so just again copy paste over here and now copy for uh, find description key just copy this thing keyboard control w and search for description key and just type hash so yeah likewise and again control x shift y and hit enter so we have done with that now just copy these two commands like this and copy this also So it's done now copy the now we are doing the task number five copy that paste over here then copy this paste then copy this and paste and now how to save 
control x shift y hit enter as simple then copy this command paste then copy this one and paste so it's done now click on check my progress so it's done now this is an important task also just copy that paste copy this and paste and copy this one also and paste click on check my progress you are done now copy this content uh, copy that command paste over here then copy this command paste over here and now we have to remove any five lines of this uh, code so here line number one line number two line number three line number four line number five okay as simple so just remove this So it's done. Now just save this file. Control X, Shift Y, hit enter. Then copy this, paste over here. Copy this, paste over here. Now again we have to remove five line. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So it's done now and control X shift Y hit enter and now just copy this paste over here copy this command paste now pay attention copy from export to equal to like this paste over here and uh, from this above output copy this first version and paste over here like this and hit enter and now this last two command if you want you can run this echo command so just so just check the uh, that version name is uh, allocated or not okay then copy this paste copy this one and paste so we are done with that Now the task number seven, copy, paste, copy this and paste. So it's done. Now no need to run this uh, examining the result. Okay. Now we can move on the task number eight. So uh, how to uh, change into task uh, project ID two? I will show you. Just open this link in incognito like this and here you can see CFC so that is the meaning of this is my first project ID and if you just scroll down here 4FB so let me just copy this click on this down arrow paste that project ID and here you can see and now I just switch to my second project ID 4FB let me just zoom out okay now first of all we have to create one bucket so just copy this project ID search for bucket and open click on that now here you can see 4fb now that's mean I'm in the second bucket uh, second project ID and then paste that project ID over here again we have to create just like same way continue continue and uncheck this like this this and click on create So we have done with that yeah it's done now now we have to upload any text file if you have uh, any text file okay so you can uh, 
use that uh, text file to upload or otherwise you can create one text file and upload it into it so i already create one text file or uh, so just click on that upload and here you can see one text file is already here like this and paste over here and it will be done now here you can see like text la dot rtf but the format must be txt so like tx txt okay so if you have any text file you can just upload it over here and once you're done with that we are good to go okay then we have to create one service account so just copy this name like this click on search for iam iam and open this thing and then click on uh, from here also you can confirm now for fb that's mean i am in the second project id service account click on create service account paste that name which we copied from here then we have to give the role subject object viewer like this click on continue in role section like this and click on continue and done now if you just click on check my progress again click on check my progress so it's done yeah it's done now it's take time to update the score so do not worry now no need to create any vm uh, actually we have to create one vm in project id1 but it's not necessary you can simply scroll down at bottom and modify roles over here and what we have to do we have to just add one role also just copy this and click on iam and here you can see cross project storage click on this pencil icon click on this uh, down arrow search for that role and click on save so now here you can see so ob uh, storage object admin now just click for check my progress okay so we have to create a vm instance also so so we have done with this task no need uh, no need of uh, the project id second so you can just cr uh, click on cross now just shift to your first project id cfc cf6 now search for vm instance and if you just scroll up and copy this name click on create instance paste the name over here like this euro paste one euro paste one and it must be d this is must be n1 standard one and change the boot disk into 10 version and click on select so we have done with this thing now just click on create so we just create one virtual machine in uh, first project id just wait for a few seconds until it gets succeed so it's done now now just go on task number last task and click on check my progress and we got a score so i hope you guys like the video if you have any doubt please let me know thanks for watching have a good day guys